Killer. Shit is murder, baby. So, my idea of a perfect Valentine for my date would probably be a little bit different. It's like, considering that everyone is gonna give you chocolate, everyone's gonna give you flowers, everyone's gonna give you a back massage and the same old stuff they've been doing since the 1950s, my idea would be a little bit different. It would be a little bit more spontaneous. It would actually take a lot more planning. I would have to find out the things that you were into. But first, I would tell you, Let's meet somewhere. How about in front of the house at 8 o'clock, right? Get in the shower, you get ready, you hop out of the shower, you come through the front door, you walk out in front of the house and what's there waiting for you? A Lincoln Town Car or something nice. Maybe a limo, I don't know. Something decent. Not an Uber, not a taxi, you know, something dope. He'll take you to a pre-designated place, a place I had already thought about, somewhere we had already been, you know, maybe a park that we've been to millions of times at Bench that you and I have been to, you know. He takes you there and what's there? It's a card, a Valentine's card. It says something mushy like, thank you for being with me, I love you, or whatever. Now our date begins. You get into the car and the driver will take you to point A, be it a dinner at your favorite restaurant. I'll be there. We eat, we get your favorite food. I say, I gotta go to the restroom, baby. I'll be right back. I get up, disappear, go to the bathroom. The waiter comes back, hands the check to the lady, but inside the check is another destination. The next destination could be the movie theater. And I, now, mind you, I've been scouting this for weeks, trying to find out what movies you wanna see, trying to find out what you're interested in. So it might not be the movie theaters, but just for instance, we hit the movie theater, you know? So after the movie, it's probably a chick flick. If she's a keeper, it'll 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 be more of a comedy. Um, We're gonna head out together. We'll go to, <laughs> we'll go to the, <laughs> After we leave the movies, we'll head out together. We'll jump in the town car. I will tell the driver to head up to the mountain. We'll go find a place to park that's overlooking the city with the beautiful lights and the stars and get a well-deserved conversation. If I don't know, an hour, maybe two. I figure you know I work hard. I know you definitely work hard. I think there's nothing better than to get a well-deserved conversation out of each other before the Valentine's Day takes its very fun and interesting end. So afterwards, we'll leave. We'll head down the mountain, go back towards the house, do whatever we do in the back seat of our awesome town car pull up to the house, I'll walk you up to the front door and I'm sure tell you how much of a great night we had and how thankful I am to have shared it with you. You know, the same old routine. Walk into the house and uh, let Valentine's Day really begin. <laughs> I'm over this, I'm out of here. <laughs>